MGF manual braces are simple to assemble four-sided hydraulic bracing systems designed to be used in conjunction with steel trench sheets or sheet piles. They are suitable for bracing small coffer dams for the installation of underground structures such as manholes, pits and tanks. Assembly commences by laying the manhole brace legs on timber skids. A bucket pump containing shoring fluid is supplied as standard together with hydraulic hoses. The hoses should be connected to the relevant valves on the manhole brace before the lock-off valve is opened. The lever arm on the bucket pump can now be used to extend the manhole brace leg. Before removal of the hoses, the lock-off valve must always be closed. The manual brace legs can now be assembled into a four-sided frame by slotting the corners together and pinning in place using the supplied pins in our clips. Once assembled, the bucket pump can be used to pump out the legs to the exact dimensions prior to installation, making suitable allowances for the ease of installation. The frame can now be lifted using an MGF four-leg chain. Installation normally commences by excavating to a maximum of 1 meter below ground level. Both manhole brace frames can now be lowered into the excavation, one on top of the other. Commence by installing 8 corner sheets using the frames as a guide. Sheets are pitched using an MGF quick release shackle and pushed gently into the trench using the excavator boom. Sufficient tow must be provided to ensure sheets cannot slip or slide. The top frame can be connected to restraining chains and pumped out to fully preload the sheets against the ground. The remaining sheets can now be pitched and driven as far as possible. An MGF driving cap should be used to drive the sheets. This will protect the sheet ends from damage. Care must be taken not to buckle the sheets. Any localised gaps between the pans of the sheets and the manual brace frame should be wedged using hardwood timber. Excavate beneath the level of the lower frame to the required level of the next frame. The sheets must be driven ahead of the dig level as the works proceeds and the lower frame dropped as the excavation works progress. Once the lower frame is at the correct level, then restraining chains can be attached between the two frames. The bottom frame can now be pumped out to preload the sheets against the ground. Excavating can continue until formation level is reached, making sure the sheets are driven ahead of the dig level. MGF supplies a comprehensive range of safety products to be used in all their shoring products. Edge protection should be installed using lightweight edge safe panels. Simply drop the clamp over the sheet and bolt in place tightly. Assembly of the ladder safe unit should commence by inserting the ladder safe extension and bolting in place tightly. Once the unit is lowered in place, the clamps can be securely tightened. A ladder can now be lashed to the ladder pole. Subject to a final inspection, the excavation is now safe to enter.